Good morning everyone, this is Yvonne from the Aussie Goddess and um, welcome to my channel. Let's see what's happening for you all on Monday the 13th of August. If you'd like to know anything about me it will be in the detailed box below. Um, remember uh, to have a look at all my other videos, I've put all the star sign videos up for the week. Please give me your feedback like and subscribe okay let's have a look at what's happening for Monday the 13th it's beautiful and sunny here in Australia such a lovely day sun's so bright for winter it's lovely okay there's your oracle card. Okay, let's get cracking. Okay, first card up for the day is the Four of Wands in reverse. Uh, so this says to me that um, somehow or another stability has been disrupted in your life. The Four of Wands in the upright talks of uh, security, stability, it can be a card of marriage. Some people talk about it being the soulmate card. Whatever this means to you, it's come up in reverse today. So it could mean that your situation has changed, your stability's um, not so stable. It could mean that something's been held up from coming to you. So let's look a little bit further. Okay, this looks like it pertains to some sort of strength. Um, this, of course, can, is the Leo card. What it looks like is that perhaps someone has been strong for a long time and is feeling like they're either giving up or they don't feel as strong as they used to. Um, sometimes, you know, with, with these cards like this, it can mean that, um, you know, something's changed where somebody's, you know, moving away from something. The, the thing is the strength card's looking straight towards this instability and I feel like it's almost like you've given up and you're looking at it from a different perspective and perhaps you're gaining strength in this situation and understanding what it is you need and you're moving, going to move on. Um, Six of Wands comes after that and it too is inverted or in reverse. Um, generally the Six of Wands in the upright talks of, you know, victory coming out on top and it's in the reverse. So Today, for, for many of you, I think that some sort of stability has been disrupted in your life and what you were moving towards that you saw was a really good thing perhaps isn't as good as what you thought and somehow or another you've gained personal strength in this situation. Ah, okay. <laughs> Radio. So it looks as though for some of you, it could have been that something has happened that was dodgy, wrong, inadvertent. Um, to me, you know, this card is the card of trickery and deceit, and it feels like that that is the case. So I would say that there's a lot of you who today will either be um, tricked by someone, somebody will take something from you, whether that's figuratively or literally, um, and they're going to move away with that. And for some unknown reason, this disrupts, it's really going to disrupt your, your security. But you have so much strength in this situation, and I think you're going to move on and feel quite confident that you've done the right thing. Even if at the moment it doesn't look like you're going to gain something from this, I feel like in the long run you're going to gain a lot. Okay, and here comes your independence and you're standing in your truth. So you're not going to hold back from this situation. I feel like you will be straightforward and up and out about it. This could be a relationship breakup for someone who's found out that their partner was perhaps not being honest with them. Um, they know that they have to go back to independence and I feel like at this stage perhaps this is a little scary. Uh, they're not quite ready for that, but the person that could have been doing this could have been a king of swords. Um, he's come in the upright, but that doesn't mean he can't be harsh and um, direct with his words. This could be your energy. But what it feels like to me is maybe you're walking away from someone who's um, been quite cruel, unrelenting, narcissistic, um, and you're moving towards your own strength and independence. 
yeah, see there, here we go. Okay, so, you know, this is a decision that you've been trying to make for a while and you finally feel like you've made this decision and you are so ready to move on. This is an end of a cycle for you. And um, look, I, I feel like even though it's in reverse at the moment, for you, you, you saw this coming, you could feel the energy around it, it was time to go and perhaps you just needed that one last sign from the universe. Okay, and you're moving on. The Six of Cups has come up here. Um, and I feel like for, for a lot of you, you're going back to how it was before this person came into your life and trying to sort of feel that happiness that you used to feel. Um, and you know you're not going to find it in this situation, so you're going to look for it elsewhere. But I feel like ultimately you are after this um, satisfaction and comfort that you had previously I feel like you know what this felt like and you're willing to walk away from this to come back to being in your true self wow that's a tough one today guys okay and the card that's come out as your oracle for the day is best friends um I think there are a couple of messages here it talks about you know seeking out best friends which you know if you've had a pretty tough time that's such a wonderful thing to do to find some comfort in someone you love whether that be a family member or a friend and the other thing too is to remember you're your, you're your own best friend it's really important that you remember you know you know best for yourself don't undersell yourself you know find what what makes your heart happy and move to it all right guys so that was your reading for monday the 13th have a wonderful day thank you